that is our dream trek, like super old school farm trek. He's gonna take the back roads because that's not a highway. <laughs> it's not a going on the highway kind of trek. favorite goatee friends. Would you like to sit on the porch? Oh yeah, that's the coolest thing ever. Hey babes. How is my favorite rice guy? Uh, how is my favorite guy? And my kitty. Huh babes? You're the most beautiful little guy. What is the matter? I am allowed to talk to the goat. What are you upset about? Hi, babes. Hi, babes. You're the prettiest little guy. Hi, baby. Oh, my goodness. I love my goats. See you later. I love you. I'm gonna go inside and talk to the cat for a minute. I'll probably find you an apple. Hey, you just stole that out of my hand. That was in my hand. That was my carrot. I didn't bring two. That was you. Don't jump on me. That wasn't nice. But I do have peanuts. Come on, let's go sit down. You and I. You, you and me and a bag of peanuts. Let's do it, friends. Oh, man, we even have our brushes here. Remember when Alvina was here and he said, hey, uh, I didn't come to get hairy. Oh, why would you come to my house if you didn't want to get animal hair on you? Hey, get off my lap. Here we get down. Get down. Okay, so I got the peanuts. Just a minute. You guys are going to need to be a little more patient. Back up. Hey, wait a minute. We're gonna re rewind. Hey, excuse me. Okay, so the bag of peanuts. Here, wait, I was gonna like peel them and do all the things. You don't even care if I peel them, do you? Don't ever jump on my lap. Get down. <laughs> Get down. Get down. <laughs> okay, I'm not sitting with you. You're not going to jump on my lap. You can have that, but you're not going to jump on my lap. Okay, we're best friends, but not this kind of best friends. You stay down. Oh, man. What? You guys are getting greedy. Okay, I'm out of here. We're, we can't be friends if you like peanuts that much. I thought they would just be a nice snack. I thought I could leisurely peel some peanuts for you. It doesn't seem like it's gonna go that way. Okay, I'm gonna take my peanuts back inside. You two are a little much. I'll come back when I've got like 10 peanuts and I'll give them to you one at a time. You are not to be trusted with my favorite yellow carrot. I can't believe you stole that out of my mouth or my hand. Rude. Okay, so I, you're gonna need to get down. Get down. Get down. I'll be back. You guys are on my list. Peace out, Boy Scouts. You know, just getting home. And my very best friends are waiting for me. Hello, friend. Hi. I don't have any peanuts, so you can just like be 
really, really sad about that. Your manners were pretty rough yesterday. Not yesterday, that was earlier today. You were very, very, like, your manners really were bad. I think you left them under the bed today. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to grab your goatee. Your goatee. Hello, friends. What did you eat while I was gone? You couldn't eat the paint off of my hood like Mimi thought because I was gone in the truck. But what did you eat? What did you eat while I was gone? I eat everything, lady. Anything that's out, I'll eat it. I'll eat it, but I don't eat vegetables. That's not good. I'm a way picky goat. I would much rather eat cardboard and paper. Hey, what else were you eating? I think you were eating a pool toy a couple days ago. You're funny. Here's a funny one. Here's a funny one. Let's go sit down. You and me will get some loving in and I will brush you. You definitely need to be brushed more. And the, the other picky guy that doesn't want hair on him, he's not here. So we can just get all hairy together. How about that guy? Let's do it. I love you. Even if you were a little demanding with the peanuts. Like, seriously, you want to know something? I thought you and I were just going to sit on the porch and I was going to slowly crack open peanuts and feed them to you one at a time. Next thing I know, you were in my lap, like demanding the whole bag. Hey, guy, that was kind of rude. We're going to have to talk about your goat manners. I love you, though. I love you so much. Hi, Rice. Hi, baby. Where's my cat? Oh, he's on his front doorstep. Hey, kitty, we set that up just for you, kitty. That's like your own million dollar oh, view, God. kitty. It's your own little place. You're just patiently waiting, huh, kitty? Kitty, we love you. It was just you and the goats, huh? You were all home alone. Oh, just kidding, you weren't alone. Lucky's here, Lucky's here. You know who else is here? <sighs> this is all great news. Hey guy, what are you doing back here? Would you like to tell him the story? Hey guy, could we talk for a minute? How'd you get in the back of the truck? Well, I would have to keep you back there until Matthew gets home, uh, but welcome back nice try anytime you want to run away why don't we just talk about it we could probably talk through our issues instead of you just running away it's it's super rude and when you run away your eye gets boogery love you mr shells i'm gonna go get you some stuff from the garden and remind you that my house is a way better place. And remember that huge den that you dug? Like, why would you leave that? You worked so hard to create that most perfect den. Lucky wants to know too. Mr. Shells, I love you so much. And I was very heartbroken when Matthew left the gate open. And if he does it again, I'm gonna take his fingers and I'm gonna like glue them glue them so they can't open a gate because he's not allowed to open gates and i need to go get you some water because you probably didn't have any water while you were gone but matthew's not home and i can't get you out you're monstrous have you ever seen my tortoise he takes up half of the bed of the truck you see how wide that too he's so big Lucky love you. Okay, I'm gonna go get you some water so you can drink while you sit back there. And I'm gonna go get you some lettuce. I'll be back. Mimi loves you. Mimi's not here anymore. You left during all of my Mimi is stuff. And you were Mimi's favorite. So that was extra heartbreaking, Mr. Shells. Don't ever, ever look for a gate that Matthew left open again, because you'll always find one. But I always want you in my life. So don't leave again. Thank you, Mr. Shells, I love you. Oh, I love you too. You're still here. You're still following me. Yeah, lady, you got this super good leg that's hard and I can rub so hard on it. Oh, yes. Hi, Rice. I love you. I love you. Hey, you were a little um, bad mannered too. We're going to have a conversation. I told Beans that we're going to have like goat training. Hey, do you think they have goat training at like PetSmart? Do you think there's like goat trainers? Or do you guys just follow me no matter what? I don't, really don't need a, a lesson on how to make a goat. Come on, come on, come on. 
welcome guys <laughs> i love you i love you so much let's go brush you it's beautiful out You guys are silly. And I love you. I have peanuts in my pocket. What are you funny guys doing? Hey, I got some peanuts. I got them in my pocket this time. I definitely didn't bring a whole bag. You are not to be trusted with an entire bag of peanuts. But, hey, I got this. Watch. Would you like one? I'd like to have you guys... Hey. Hey. Relax. Relax, Mato. What are you doing? <laughs> Pips, they're giving you a show. Got you ready? That's what you get for button heads. Yeah, I love you guys. Wait a minute, it's Rice's turn. Just one. Bye, babe. Have fun. I love you. You got everything out of the pool, right? Thank you. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> I love you so much. Okay, you ready for another one, Beans? There you go. It's Rice's turn. Why you gotta be in my bubble? It's a good thing my camera has a wide angle zoom. Oh, yes. Oh, you can have the whole thing. You got a little on your nose. I'll wipe it off for you. Oh, okay. Kitty, I didn't bring you any. Okay, that's it. That's all I got. I know, that's super sad, huh? Oh, it's so sad. Even the kitty's sad for you. Even the kitty is sad. <laughs> Let's look at your teeth. Can I look at your teeth? I want to see your teeth. What are you doing? Okay, let's go sit down and get brushed. <laughs> Way to get excited. Way to get excited. I'm going to sit down. They get super excited when I sit down. But this time I don't have any peanuts, but I got a brush. I'm going to brush you. Are you ready? Look, it even has goat hair on it. Okay, come here. Come here. Let's brush you. Rice loves it. Rice loves to be brushed. You just want food. Even though you're the pickiest goat ever. Come on over here. Let me brush you. I'm not going to brush you over there. That You're on the wrong side. Come here, Beans. I'll brush you over here. Come here. He's, he's super difficult. Doesn't want to be brushed. Doesn't want to eat greens. What kind of goat are you? You're just the kind of goat they talk about. The kind that just is destructive and eats everything. Kitty, come here. I'll brush you, kitty. Come here. Well, come here. I'll brush you.
Hey, don't go in that house. Who left the door open? No, don't go in. Please don't go in. Please don't go in. No, no, come on. You're out. Come on, this way. Out, out, out. Come on. Come here. I have more peanuts. Can I talk you into peanuts? I was just kidding. I don't have any peanuts, but thank you for coming. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Let me get this door right where it's supposed to be. I'm gonna have it closed in no time. Because you guys already got in the house today. You don't need to come in in two days, twice in one day. Oh, beans, that for rice, that feels so good. Come on, let's go sit down and I'll brush you. I don't want to brush you, you don't want to be brushed. Hey, Rice, I could find you something way better to eat, and I know you're not even hungry. You ate that like that was not your first time eating a cardboard box. Hey, it's uh, definitely not trash, it's building materials. You know, because we're remodeling around here. Hey, Beans, could you eat those weeds right there, please? Lady, I do not eat weeds. I am way too cool for that. Hey Beans, I just want you to know that I admire your dedication to being picky. You definitely never ever stray from how picky you are. And then there's rice, he'll just eat anything. Kitty, come over here. I'm sorry they were yelling at you. I know, I saw him. I know, he was kind of telling you to be on your way. He's, I know, it's that's how I knew he said I could have chickens. Because he doesn't want you anywhere near. He doesn't want any of my cats near. Okay, so Kitty, we need to find Franklin. Where's Frank? Where's my Frank? Kitty, where's my other kitty? Can I brush you? We'll go get the Furminator.
bit of your kind of at a weird angle. I could probably go get the cat ferminator. It would fit your little tiny body a whole lot better, but you would just rather I not stop. Get that booty in the air, kitty. What you doing? Does that feel so amazing? You can't see it, but his booty is in the air. He does not want me to stop. Amazing, huh? Kitty, it's gonna be that time of year. We gotta strip it down and get that ferminator going every day, kitty. This is when we give all the birds some new nesting. Look at him. Let me do your side. Okay, I'll do your side. Let me do your belly. I'll do your belly. Oh, kid, it's the most amazing to be without any hair. Oh, man, kitty. Oh, it feels so good.